What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video, another reaction. Today, guys, we got something that I had been waiting for. Um, but once they finally came out, I just forgot. Uh, not because I just didn't know that they were out, but just in general, just forgot about it. Uh, so probably for the future ones, I should probably set a timer when they come out. Uh, because I know the next one comes up this next Monday because they were doing a release every Monday, which is actually insane for them to do. Um, but we got Mad World bass singer cover featuring Elliot Michael Robinson. So if you don't know who Elliot Robinson is, he's a insane, insane bass. Uh, definitely probably out there right now has one of the lowest chest ranges of all time. Uh, I think there was a bass battle back um, not too long ago where he went down to like a C sharp one, C one, uh, and just chess, which when you think about it is actually insane. Um, and then obviously having the rest of the guys. So five super low bases in one song uh, can only mean good things. Uh, so I know obviously Pentatonix has done this, but I'm not going to compare it to Pentatonix just because while I like Pentatonix's version, this is probably going to be completely or completely different from theirs. Um, and I believe this is Tommy P's arrangement for this one because I know they each are doing an arrangement and stuff for each video. Yeah, so arranged, mixed, and edited by Tommy P. Uh, so yeah, without further ado, let's get right on into this. I'm excited. start with the belt that that's definitely a tommy thing now that, like this is definitely something tommy would do with a bunch of bell tones and then each bell tone either being high and then slowly going lower uh, down to a Listen, Peter. I, I know. I know. I reacted to some of y'all. I just. I've reacted to Tommy P stuff, hey Peters. Um, I know Marwin has some stuff, and a lot of Bobby stuff is on TikTok. Um, but I have seen all their stuff differently. So I mean, I I know what they're cap capable of for sure. Uh, like my favorite from Peter is probably Creep by Radiohead. My favorite from Tommy is probably Hellfire from The Hunchback. Um, so he's just singing it and then casually and then Peter's... Uh, dude, it's, it's Charles. Races, going nowhere, going nowhere. <laughs> Their tears oh. are filling up good. their glasses. No expression, no expression. And just dropping the subs, dude. He didn't have to drop it down there for the song, but he he blessed us with it, and I'm glad. Right. I'm dying are the best I've ever had. 
I find it hard to tell you I find it hard to tell When people run in circles It's a very, very Wait, what? Okay, wait <laughs> This whole This whole little thing That just happened The last, like 20, 30 seconds I, I don't even know What, what they're doing anymore Kind of funny, I, I find it kind of sad. The dreams in which I'm dying are the best I ever had. I find it hard to tell you, I find it hard to tell. When people run in circles, it's a very, very. Dude, I love that undertone from. People run in circles, it's a very, very bad. Hey, yeah, he's probably just making it just as good. Mad world. Definitely, definitely belt on the side high notes and then these guys are harmonizing tenor baritones I, I i'm loving the high stuff like i know this is bass king so we're supposed to feature like you know pay attention to the bass but like you gotta get props so like uh i believe marlon's doing a lot of the percussion in these if i'm not mistaken i know peter does uh some vocal percussion and they all can but uh I think Marwin and Peter are kind of ones holding it down in most of these songs. So, I mean, shout out to the stuff and not just the basses, you know. I mean, how do you do the basses? It's, it's all insane. I don't, I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. I know, but is, is Elliot just going super low in the background? I mean, obviously, he's right here, but... What is that? And I find it kind of funny I find it kind of sad The dreams in which I'm dying Are the best I've ever I like that, Tommy. I like that. I find it hard to take when people run in circles. It's a very, very Is here, guys. May the bass be with you. Volume two is fun. So I believe that's a C two. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, yeah, but I know it's dropped down to a C one. Yeah, that's hold them. Were they all hitting C1s? They had to, right? Like subharmonics, inhales, growls, chest. What? 
I, yeah, I don't, I don't know. We got two other songs coming up later. Uh, probably we'll all get filmed today and then I'll release one maybe either later today or tomorrow. And then the next one, either later tomorrow or that night, but we'll see. I don't know, dude. These are all, they're insane. Um, but yeah, I, I, I'm stunned. I mean, the first one uh, where they did a bunch of their favorite Billy Eilish songs, I mean, they did insane there. Um, and then they obviously did Emperor's New Groove. Uh, were they all featured in the Wellerman? Misty Mountains video down here? I believe they were. Not 100%, but I'm, I'm like 90% sure they were. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely excited for Centuries with Jonathan. Then Young and then uh, Melinda with Iris because Iris is one of my favorite songs of all time. I like that. It's just it's so good. Um, but yeah, I'm not gonna keep you guys much longer. If you guys did like the video, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe below if you're new. You have my love and affection forever. Also, comment down in the comment section below what you guys want to see me react to next. Uh, also, my PayPal link will be in the description below if you guys want to go help out the channel. Uh, all money donated down there comes straight back to the channel for new equipment and different things like that. You also get two free reactions of your choice. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.